Hello everybody and welcome to a gory episode of Tiny Little Games, the show where I can't afford real to play games, but sometimes I review mobile pay to play games. Consider it a public service, as if I'm the yelper of mobile games. Today I'm reviewing Slay Away Camp, because if 1980s horror flicks taught me anything, it's not to run. Running never works. How do these slasher dudes get around so fast? Slay Away Camp is developed by Blue Wizard Digital and is available on Android and Apple devices. First up, gameplay. A slasher maneuvering camper annihilating movie watching diabolical brain melting puzzler. Anybody familiar with Hitman Go will see a resemblance. You slide to move your villain, working your way through a maze-like puzzle in order to massacre helpless, simple-minded college kids. The beginning levels start out simple enough, but soon you'll be axing your brain on how to achieve gory kills and escape through the hellish vortex. Oh, and the kills are a glorious scene of bloody disembodiment. Awesome! Each set of levels play out as movie scenes, and unlocking other movies in VHS format was ridiculously funny and nostalgic. Each movie brings in new slasher dudes, and the clever characters added more 80s movie flair. Beating levels grant you bonus kill games that earn you more coin, use that coin to purchase new kill skills, or use them to unlock more villains. A killer fridge? This campy comedy just won't quit. You can also use coin to get hints on hard levels, or uncover the solutions if you're about to rage quit. Altogether, the gameplay is both challenging and devilishly fun. Discovering unique ways to kill throwaway characters was fantastic, and finally beating a harsh level was rewarding. <gasps> Next up, graphics! As if Jason built a gaming PC, but decided that Minecraft was his game of choice. The graphics have the blocky, low-budget look that has become popular over the last few years. Normally, I'm not a fan of this look, however here it just works. The animations are both bloody and blocky. The colors are great meshes of low textures, and the environments all look like a 12-year-old spinning nightmare in Minecraft. The graphical style really complements the game, and makes for some hilarious gory kill moments. Every character has a unique look, making playing as other villains worth it. The minions are crisp and clean, looking through VHS tapes with movie synopsis was surprisingly funny. Replaying kills and villain intros gave a laugh, and the whole graphical theme is consistently great, like a B-movie on an A-movie budget. Finally, replayability. Like re-watching your favorite Friday the 13th movie, Jason X. Oh yeah! The game has plenty of levels, I've unlocked 6 of 11, and the amount of challenging sections has already got me clamoring for more. Replay levels to earn kill coins, or play bonus deleted scenes. You can play through a special VHS that consists of mini kill games for even more hilarious deaths and bloody coins. Making coins to buy more characters and kills added a sense of addictiveness that I was not expecting. Altogether, the replayability is surprisingly present, like when the one character you thought was gonna die, but actually survives the whole movie. Now, I rate my pay to play games on a 3 point scale, that's buy it, wait for sale, or ditch it. Slay Away Camp butchers, drowns, and explodes its way in as a buy it! Yay! A blocky massacre extravaganza. For $2.99, the game is worth your blood and sweat. The gameplay is a campy puzzler, the graphics are blocky bloody, and the replayability is a movie marathon. Now there are other titles in this genre, however the challenging kills and campy comedy made this one stand out. I laughed, I cringed, and I came back for more gory puzzle fun. The excitement of what funny VHS came next was the driving force in this addictive puzzler. So if you're in the market for a game that celebrates 80s horror while picking your empty brain, then get this game. Or if you ever wanted to scare the daylight out of happy campers, then buy it. As always, thanks for watching Tiny Little Games. Please subscribe to support my channel, like for more pay to play reviews, and share so others can experience my content. Time for me to put on my hockey mask and play hockey. What, you thought I was going camping? <laughs>